My name is Captain Robert Long. I'm the intelligence officer for 2nd Battalion, 2nd Marines. And for this exercise, I am acting as the role player coordinator and as a lane controller. What we did yesterday uh, here at Mount Town, we simulated that uh, we had a, a town that was occupied by a hostile force or a mix of a hostile force and civilians. The Marines, the entire battalion, would be coming in and clearing the town. The first thing we did was we did a call out uh, of the civilians. We said, hey, we're coming in to clear the Boko Haram out of your town. Uh, we need all the civilians who are not hostile to us to come out of town. And then the Marines with tanks attached and CAT rolled through, cleared out the town. The Marines playing aggressors were our 81's platoon, dressed in civilian clothes uh, and organized under their platoon commander, Lieutenant Peak. And then in addition to that, we had West African role players from Defense Training Systems, DTS. The Marines playing Marines, and as, as well as the Marines playing the aggressors, wearing what's known as Miles gear. Uh, basically what it is, it's a system of, uh, of sensors that you wear on your body and on your helmet, and you put a, a laser device on the end of your rifle. Uh, so when you fire a blank, it fires a laser in the direction that that round would go, and it sends a signal to that to those sensors, telling you whether it was a kill, whether you're wounded, basically giving you some feedback. So it's not just blanks on blanks. It's hey, I actually know that I hit that person when I shot at him, and he's dead. On the uh, on the Marine side, on the the two two side, uh, one of the things that I saw that I really liked was just the aggressiveness of the Marines. You know, they came in here, they were serious about the training. They wanted to clear this town out. They did an excellent job, you know, from the individual to the team, to the squad, to the platoon, to the company level, really all the way up and down the, uh, the entire chain. Uh, and from the role player side, we really saw them get into their roles. Uh, they, they really enjoyed it. Both the, the DTS guys and the Marines enjoyed kind of playing the bad guy, acting like the insurgents. Um, and really getting into it and giving the Marines who are clearing the town a very realistic and very competent aggressor force. You know, the reason we do this training is to get ready for contingencies that may lie ahead. When this battalion goes on deployment, its primary mission is crisis and contingency response. Wherever we're called on to do it in whatever situation we're called on to do it in, I think these Marines are ready. All the civilians that we pulled out of town and evacuated yesterday, we've got them back over here in a safe area. Uh, and what we're working on doing now is getting ready to reintegrate them back into the town. So we're getting information on who they are, where they live, um, and then eventually we'll start bringing them back out into town and assessing what, if any, damage was done to their homes. Take you back to your city, your, your home safely. They can fill out claims forms uh, and we can try to reimburse them for any damage that was done to their homes in the process. So what that does is it gets us set to turn this town back over to the local security forces so we can go on to our next mission.